statistics says somebody I'm not sure how they calculated that but that on the average we think about 10 to 20 something thousand thoughts a day the interesting part is 70 percent of all of our thoughts are repetitive that means they're coming from before thoughts that we've thought, thought before your subconscious mind is 30 times 30,000 times more powerful than your conscious mind your subconscious mind means your mindset is 30,000 times more powerful than your mind 95% of all your behaviors are automatic a normal human can speak at the speed of 200 to 300 words per minute your subconscious mind can think at the rate of a thousand words per minute your subconscious mind can process 30 million bits of information per second while our conscious mind can only process 40 bits of information per second our subconscious mind makes 88% of our brain capacity. You control your mind. Your mindset controls you. Have you ever sent an email to someone who is out of the office and before even they read the email you already got the response? Out of the office response? They're saying, I am out of the office from this day to that day. And it's called automatic response. Your mindset, your subconscious, this is where the strongholds are at. This is where things are built with time over time. They become part of automatic response to a situation and most of you if you just pay attention tomorrow at work how you speak to the family how you speak to the co-workers how you kind of live through what you do you will realize that so much of automatic response comes out quickly and that comes out because your mind you can control your mindset you cannot Anytime I heard message on thoughts or importance of you know strongholds and everything one of the first things that I wanted to do always is I wanted to change my mindset. I was like man my mindset was so in, uh, when I was younger my mindset was full of insecurity. My mindset was full of people don't like me. People always reject me. Everywhere I went in I felt like nobody people just were not nice to me so I blamed it on people then I realized the fault was mine not theirs. And so when I realized the fault was mine I said okay I'm gonna go and change my mindset. I'm just gonna read one book and my mindset is gonna change. I read one book my mindset didn't change. I read the second book my mindset didn't change. It took one month my mindset didn't change and I became disappointed and I said the preacher lied. You cannot change your mind. You can change your mind. You just cannot change your mindset. You say I don't understand. Hang in there. You can only change what you fill your mind with which over time spills and becomes the mindset but you can never ever change a mindset only your mind whatever is filled with changes your mindset you cannot do that so the mistake we make is when we find insecurity when we find depression when we find rejection when we find hate when we find constant thoughts of jealousy what we do is we say well i'm just gonna go find me a bible verse and i'm gonna change my mindset and you will quickly find out that's not gonna happen you can only fill your mind and once it fills to the capacity it spills and becomes the mindset but listen not in one day because it didn't take one day to develop the very mindset you are trying to change today can somebody say yes